make sure that you have built and installed the library file in Linux. See the previous tutorial, Episode 3, Software Preparation, for more information. To build the read-write example, go to the read-write's makefile directory by typing in the following command in Terminal. Linux 32 or 64 depending on your system. You can list out the files in this directory and see that makefile is here. Then, build the executable file by typing in the following command in Terminal. If there is an error, make clean, then make again. To delete the executable file, make clean. If you have successfully built the executable file, you will see it in the same directory as the read-writes makefile directory when you list out the files. Now you are ready to run the example. To access the port and connect to Dynamixel, type in the following command in Terminal. Finally, run the source code. Now, keep your eyes on the blue tape on the Dynamixel. If I press Enter, the Dynamixel moves from goal position 100 to goal position 4000, or vice versa, and prints the present position values to the screen. Every time I press Enter, or any other key, it does the same thing. You can access readwrite.cpp in the readwrite protocol 1.0 directory and open the file in the getit text editor.